Good morning, good afternoon, good evening, YouTubers. This is Jerry Diamond with How to Get Out of Babylon. And another facet of having meat on the hoof and crops in the ground that my son has not addressed, and that is the cattle operation is pretty much solar powered. In other words, they walk around on their own two feet. Uh, they do, like in this case, they're taking them quite a ways, but we used to just run them down the road. We'd close the highway off and yeah. flag it and move the cattle, and the cattle walked. But yeah. I keep telling them you ought to have a couple of horses. You ought to have a couple of horses with them that could be saddled up and ridden. One time we did a cattle drive, and this guy did a was able to ride with him, and and the next day on Facebook he said, "Yesterday was the greatest birthday of my entire life. I was able to ride my horse on a cattle drive." So these guys are going quite a ways. It's not, it's way too far to, uh, uh, you know, walk them. So they're doing them by trailer. But a lot of times, you know, we just run one string of. They were using electric little strand just to throw it against trees and stuff and on bushes and, and I said, you know, that stuff's expensive. Your cattle respect just a piece of white line. So I, he, my son went to Home Depot and got a whole reel of um, just that poly twine that you tie packages up at the door. Dirt cheap. If they didn't get it back, who cares, you know? There's a lot of it spread out around. So these are the, be the second load here. There's a pretty good looking bull there. And most of these were calves. And there's the only horse he's got. Quad. It's got four wheels. And it's only two wheel drive though. Because he doesn't have um, the four wheel drive ain't working on it. But that thing there, that's real four wheel drive. And she thinks I'm going to feed her. So, too bad. And there's a the farm dog, Jada. Let's go, Jada. Let's go. Come on. Come on. Let's go. Come on, let's go. Come on, Jada. Hold on. She saw the other pup over here. Boy, she came running full blast, barked at it, and came running over here and found out it was her buddy. She thought it was an intruder. Shirley said the dog was in there with the horses this morning, and all three of them were just having a blast. They were just, the horses were kicking up their heels, their back legs, and just having a the time of their lives with that dog running around with them. They survived winter. <laughs> Can you get the gate open? Can you open the gate for me? Why can't you? Can you? Why should I when I got you here? Because I want you to. Because you know how to do it. No, I, I don't. There. Yes, you do. No, I don't. Yeah, you do. Pick that chain out of the little hole there. Come on. Mm -mm. Oh, yeah. I know You're not riding the quad then. No, I don't do I'll just take Israel out on the quad. Okay, good. <laughs> Motivation. You just gotta know how to motivate them. Kid don't know how to open a gate right. <laughs> Pulls this way. Israel, get out of the way. Get out of the way, Israel. Walk on the other side of it. You know how to hook it, right? Run it around the post and hook it. Well, hook it in the little, drop it in the latch like the other one was in the latch. The little slot. No, the slot. There you go. All right, Jada, get out of the way. We're going to run you over. We're going to run you over, Jada. Jada. Watch this. Hi, you goats. 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 Hi, you goats.